It's time for Pet of the Week, and today we have uh, Megan who brought us a Kesha. Uh, <laughs> tell us a little bit about uh, Kesha here. Oh, so Kesha is a skipper key mix. Uh, she's about four years old, and oh my gosh, she is such a doll. She just really loves mm -hmm. human companionship. She's good with other dogs. She's right. good with kids. She just loves love. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and, you, and you said that this is actually the second time that she's been with you guys. Yeah, so she was found as a stray a while back, and we adopted her out. And unfortunately, that home didn't work out. So mm -hmm. she is back with us, mm -hmm. um, and she's been put up for adoption today. She is an absolute mm -hmm. kennel favorite. Um, she was wearing a sweater when I picked her mm -hmm. up. Mm -hmm. And she will just melt your heart. Uh, mm -hmm. She does need basic training. Right. Um, she could definitely, you know, she definitely, be, just because she's a small dog, yeah. and people assume they don't need exercise. She needs a lot of exercise, mm -hmm. but she will also sit on that couch with you and love on you. She right. does have some separation anxiety, so she's looking for a home where there's lots of family around, mm -hmm. people around. You're not gone all day long. Right, right. Um, and just, yeah, just looking for the, that, that special family. Yeah, that's awesome. And like you said, they, they need a little bit of, uh, you know, somewhere to run around a little bit, so maybe it's more with a, like a yard possibly. A yard's always ideal, mm -hmm. but if you make the, if you don't have a yard or you live in an apartment, it's okay. Just take them on walks. Yeah. It gets you outside to exercise. It gets them exercised. So, so everyone can accomplish their New Year's resolution. Ex again. Exactly. <laughs> it's one of the many New Year's resolutions we have, right? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> but uh, also you said that, yeah, construction's uh, still going under, underway at uh, a Green Hill. That's right. Green Hill. We have our second kennel where the roof is on. Mm -hmm. So now we have, um, they're just working on getting everything together. We're working on our medical clinic. Mm -hmm. We're still fundraising for this effort. Um, we're midway through, um, but we are so excited to have all the animals together at Green Hill, ideally in March. Mm -hmm. Until then, all of our dogs are at the First Avenue shelter, right. and all of our cats and small animals are at the Green Hill location. Mm -hmm. But the goal is March that we are all together one big happy family. And we'll keep our fingers crossed oh. on, on that one for sure. And then you so see us also cat yoga coming we up. We do as have well. cat yoga coming up. A uh, Eugene Yoga hosts um, a, a yoga class mm -hmm. in our cattery, and that's j January. January 13th. <laughs> wow, it's almost January. Yeah. Um, January 13th on a Sunday. And please just go to Eugene Yoga um, to sign up. Yep. Um, it will fill up. So if you are interested, we do suggest you sign up beforehand. Awesome. All right. Well, if you are interested in adopting Ketcher or any pet at Green Hill, you can get a hold of them at 541-689-1503. Remember, again, all dogs are being housed at that First Avenue shelter. The rest are at still at Green Hill. You can find all the information on our website, kzi.com.